Hey guys, we're back with another one. Did you miss us? It's chicken palm throw down time. Going right across the street, we are in Canton Center in Massachusetts, uh, going to Washington Street, going to try Rosetta's. Rosetta's Italian family restaurant. We've heard great things about it, and we heard there's a chicken parm or parm special tonight that we're excited to see what it's all about. All right, so we're going to check out the food, the ambiance, of course, have some drinks. Stay tuned, guys. We're going to give it to you all. All right, guys, the drinks are the right. I got a Peroni, of course, and the lovely Jen has gotten a Chianti. Once again, this is Rosa, Rosetta's Italian uh, restaurant. And there's the menu, guys. And here are the appetizers. Salads. And the specials. But what we're here for, guys, is the chicken parm. Wednesday night, $12 chicken parm. Stay tuned, guys. Let's see a quick glance at the drink menu here. Various wine selections, that's beer and beer as well. And red wine over here. And I believe Jen went with the Chianti. Chianti. Where is that? Right here. Rosa, Roca de Maki Chianti. And then they also had a special menu, but uh, like I said. Entrees. What's for dessert on the special? Dessert special is lemon cello cake or chocolate chip cookie gelato. And then the last page of the menu, which I think you missed pizza. And what else? Paninis. And bagas. So back to this parm special that we're going to do tonight. Um, it looks like Wednesday parm, twelve dollars. You can do eggplant parm, chicken parm, veal parm for dining only with purchase of beverages, no combos. And also they do have outside seating available, which we saw on our way in. Absolutely, guys. Stay tuned. We got more Cheers. content for you. Cheers, guys. So on the menu it reads, as a young girl growing up in Avellino, Italy, Rosetta learned from her nana and mother how to prepare Italian dishes. Rosetta took these recipes from her passion for cooking to her with, to, with her to Boston and passed them along to her children. Rosetta's Italian restaurant specializes in preparing authentic Italian food while providing impeccable service in a family-friendly atmosphere at moderate prices. And I just love that picture that they use. I mean, that is straight out of an 80s wedding. Like, that looks like exactly what you want a 1980s Italian wedding to look like. <laughs> that looks like my family. Manja tutti manja, guys. And look at the old school paintings they got on the ambience of the walls there, too. Pretty cool, guys. Cheers. Cheers. All right, guys, we're going to give a little recap on the bread. Jen's going to give her a score right now. I'm gonna go ahead and say this is the best bread we have had um, since we've been doing the chicken parm throwdown. It's fresh, crispy on the outside, nice, warm, and soft on the inside. And I don't know what this is. It doesn't necessarily taste like olive oil. It tastes a little buttery, but delicious. It's got those Italian seasonings in there. We topped it off with Parmesan cheese, and it's delicious. I'm going best yet. It's ni nice and warm, very tasty, absolutely. I agree with Jen. It's probably the best bread we had on the chicken parm throwdown so far. And we got our appetizer right now, and it's another bread. So we're going bread overload right now. We got the bruschetta. Looks nice and fresh. Look at those fresh tomatoes. Looks pretty good with the balsamic drizzle. So we're going to go yeah. with that right now, and I'll let you know what you think. Stay tuned for that first bite. All right, Michael is cutting into his mozzarella bruschetta. Those tomatoes are nice and fresh. We're, neither of us are big tomato fans, but they are looking plump and delicious. Mm. Covered with that balsamic glaze and vinegar. Really, really yummy. Top with basil. Michael, what do you think of that first bite? It's excellent. We had the bruschetta at the main nose, and this is better. So this is going to give. This is going to be about a nine point two. Delicious. Thank you. I want Ladies and gentlemen, the PA's that resistance has arrived. That chicken parm. Steaming hot, steaming hot. We just got some grated cheese on there. Of course, I had to add some crushed black pepper, and we are ready to dive in. Michael's going for that first bite. Let's see that ooey gooey cheese ball. Ooh, there it is, guys. We know it's hot. How's it taste? Your mouth's on fire. <laughs> That's a good thing. Pound it pretty thin, and it's nice and crispy. Let's see. Oh yeah, that looks so good. All right, we just ordered another round of drinks and uh, we will check in in a bit, guys. Hey right, guys, a lovely Jen has taken her first bite of the, um, the chicken parm. What's your score, young lady? It's delicious, um, nice white meat chicken. Homemade pasta is delicious. I um, 
decided to get sauce on, on top this time instead of on the side. It's a yummy, great flavor. I'm into it. Everything is up to par. Nice crispiness served hot. Um, I think I'm going at least a 9.3 after my first bite. Wow, she went 9.3. I'm going to go 8.5. 8.5 for the chicken parm for me. All right, everyone, after a delicious chicken parm dinner, it's dessert time, and we went with the... Tiramisu. Tiramisu. Carlo, the um, owner here, stopped by to check on our meal and see how everything was, and he sent us over to us complimentary, so we are so excited to give it a try. Uh, we just found out that it is homemade, so you can't eat that, and I'm a big coffee fan, so you know I'm going to love this no matter what. You want to go with that first bite? Sure. That's a little spin, see what it's all about. It's delicious, your classic tiramisu, great flavor, fluffy insides, whipped cream on the outside, topped with some chocolate sauce, I'm into it. Alright guys, stay tuned for the happy recap. Alright guys, we're here with the happy recap of Rosetta's. We love that. Fantastic meal. For the price point, you couldn't go wrong. I had three Peronis, Jen had three glasses of wine, we had an appetizer, an entree, and a dessert. It came out to $71, not too shabby, guys. This is our outside seating here, which is a new addition, I believe. We didn't sit outside today, but it looks like lots of people are enjoying it, starting to pick up for dinner time now. We came on the earlier side, but we are so happy we came. Kim was our server. She took great care of us, and Carlo, the owner, manager, was amazing and hooked us up with that great Absolutely. time, too, which you can't go wrong with that. Can't go wrong with that. I'm not even a coffee fan. And I devoured that tiramisu as much as the lovely Jen did. So I re again, this is right um, on Washington Street in Canton. We love it. We'll be back. Support your troops. Show love. Eat good Italian food. Cheers to you guys. And support your local businesses. Yes. All right. As always, peace. Subscribe. Love. Keep drinking and sub click and subscribe. And check us out on, on YouTube and Instagram, guys. We're going to do a walk through this outside area so you guys can see what we're working off. And we're going to uh, we'll see you later. All right. Take care, guys.